Hey y'all, it's Betsy with Happily Ever After Etc. and welcome back to another garden video. Today I'm doing a bit of much needed fall maintenance. Um, I've been needing to do some things like cut back the coneflowers. We just did that in a different video. Still need to clean this up. I need to weed a few things. I need to cut back plants that are done for the season or on the struggle bus and might bloom again. Some of these salvia could be cut back. A lot of the glads need to be picked up and pulled. Lamb's ear needs to be cleaned up. Just a lot of fall things. The zinnias need cut back. So I don't know how much we're going to get done today, uh, but we're just going to get started and see what happens. Waited till the end of the day because it has been hot, hot, hot. And uh, I have put on mosquito spray. I can literally hear it rumbling right now, so it may start thundering and we may have to make a run for it. But at the moment, we're just going to go for it. Now before I throw away, well throw away, toss into the, the compost pile or the woods, um, all of the coneflowers that I cut back, cut back everything to just above a healthy bud. I have quite a few coneflowers here that still have seeds on them. So I'm going to take them around the garden where I want more coneflowers and just direct seed. Why not? Got quite a few that way. There's no reason to throw things out. I'm going to get a million right here next season because I forgot to put down my mat and uh, there's seeds everywhere. Seeds. I'll get my leaf blower and see if I can't blow some back in this garden bed where I want more. Now, of course, I could dig and plant them and water them in, but when it comes to direct seeding, we just do things kind of the way Mother Nature does. And we sprinkle a whole bunch of seeds and chaff, and nine times out of 10, We'll get at least a couple. Found a garden marker I thought was lost. Hoping maybe my good scissors were down there because those have also been lost. Ever since I cut back the bee bomb, we're in the bee bomb area.
All right, y'all, in about an hour, we cut back the zinnias, staked them up, cut back the short zinnias. We weeded uh, the path in this section of the garden. We cut back the salvia, we cleaned up the lambs here, we cut back some of the zinnias up here. And honestly, I'm pretty happy with that. Obviously, uh, there is always more that can be done, but gardening is supposed to be fun and not a chore. It's a chore. <laughs> Either way, the rain is coming. The, the sun is going down, even though it looks pretty bright on camera. Um, and my bug spray is wearing off. So I'm going inside and we will do more maintenance another day. Hope you enjoyed gardening with me today. And I hope you have time to get into your garden. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thank you.